Hi everybody, welcome to Rescapers. My name is Sebastian and today with Amelie we're going to explain to you how to build a coral frame from the beginning. So here we have a small Rescapers coral frame which is number 107. So this coral frame is made of iron with a layer of sand on top of it which is natural coral reef uh, sand. So this coral frame I made on a local island called Fuladu in the Bar Atoll providing employment for local communities. So the corals, what are they made of? So corals is actually an animal formed of small polyps, which are the same family as a jellyfish, the anemone, and they have a skeleton. The skeleton is made of calcium carbonate. So those individual polyps, they live inside the skeleton of the corals, and all of them together, they form a coral colony. So we just collected 41 coral fragments from our coral nursery. So we have a lot of mature coral colonies. Uh, we collected one or two fragments from each colony, which doesn't impact the whole colony. But in return, this coral fragment is going to grow and create a new colony. So by putting the, the coral fragment like this, right on the bar, uh, it should not be moving. We will attach this fragment solidly to the bar. This fragment is then going to attach to the frame attached to the bar and then it's gonna grow and create new branches over time where the fish can go and hide inside those branches. At Reefscapers, one of the main aspects of a coral restoration project is the monitoring. So what we do is that we take picture of a coral frame every six months. We do this to be able to have a full picture of the frame from four different angles to see the coral growth over time, to see the survival rate, the mortality rate, and to see how much fish uh, diversity has increased. Once the pictures are taken, we upload them on Rescapers website using QGIS software. So we have a special code to upload them online where we can see the depth, the location, and the size of the frame. It's also for the sponsor to be able to see the coral frame online so they can see the coral growing over time. And for us, we can collect data on the coral growth and on the survival rate. If you want to help us protect the Maldivian reef, you can sponsor your own coral frame online and then you can see the corals growing over time from your home.